Playoff season is in full swing for almost all fall sports in Minnesota, including cross country. The Section 7 championships were down at the Cloquet Country Club two-day. In the 7 AA boys race, Cameron Stocky jumped out in front coming around the first turn, and the Rockridge Jr. put his foot on the gas from there, opening up a huge gap on the home stretch. Stocky wins it with a time of 16 minutes and 13 seconds. His Rockridge teammate Aaron Nelson was 28 seconds behind him in second, followed by Cloquet's Miles Fisher in third. I came into the season definitely not where I wanted to be, but it finally feels like I'm over the hump a little bit. So I finally feel like I'm back to a certain extent. Um, yeah, it really gives me a lot of confidence going to the state meet because there's some fast kids down there. So. Rockridge and Cloquet qualified for state as a team. In the Section 7A single, the GNK and Esco boys are headed to state. Cromwell writes Noah Foster won the race with a time of 16 minutes and 33 seconds. In the girls' race, more dominance from Rock Ridge, but this time from an 8th grader. This is Lexi Lampa. She was 8 spots away from going to state last season as a 7th grader, but dropped 50 seconds on her time today. 19 minutes, 10 seconds, 47 seconds ahead of the field. Her twin sister, Maya, was 3rd. Grace McCormick from Duluth Denfield came in 2nd. It was good. First round, I felt really good, and then it just felt good. I never, got to, I never felt super tired. I didn't have any side aches, I just felt good. I just kept dropping, dropping time, dropping time every race. Hibbing and Cook County finished one and two as teams and will advance to state. In seven single-A girls, Carlton and Southridge each earned trips to state. Addison Burkhart of Southridge came in first with a time of 19 minutes, 54 seconds, three seconds ahead of Ely's Molly Brophy.